strength it is also bringing you um, the energy of new beginnings and there's new beginnings here you're um, walking away from things and leaving things behind new beginnings and a new part new energies vibrations are coming up in your life as we look at Monday, we have um, your energy vibration, which is the three of ones. The three of ones is wonderful because you're leaving things behind. You're looking forward to new things. Your financial situation is being in balance. So whatever that was happening, you are moving away and you are looking for new, better waters and your financial situation will be balanced. As we look at Tuesday, you have your own uh, and you have the worries in uh, the nine of swords in um, reverse so you are not worried about anything and whoever an uh, Aries or Aquarius or um, a Libran person or Gemini person is trying to affect your life it's not going to happen because there is no worry you're worried about nothing and Wednesday we have the energy vibration of uh, you being in limbo which is a, a good day because what is happening is a, that your day of cleansing on Wednesday Wednesday is good because Archangel Michael always come in on Wednesday and he is helping you to cleanse whatever that was going on it's not going to affect you anymore on Thursday you have the energy vibration of the Queen of Sword this is what I was saying uh, she seems to be a parent so a lot of um, people airy uh, Aquarians um, Gemini's and Libra people are going to be coming up in your life but you're not afraid of them because you're walking away from them you're walking away from them so wh whoever these Aquarians are that wants to come and affect your life you're just gonna walk away from this person is not going to have an effect on you anymore Achievement is going to be wonderful, and if your father is is of an um, er, an, an fire energy, achievement is going to be wonderful. Uh, your father is going to help you to bring back new energies, success, and a wonderful experience in your life. So, whoever and whatever is affecting you, um, the energy of you. For some people it's going to be promotion for some people it's going to be bringing stability in your life for some people it's a partner coming in with a fire energy is going to bring in stability in your life which is going to be wonderful and this is going to be good as we look forward we have the eight of Pentacles and Saturday this eight of Pentacles is good because with your financial um, situation coming in balance you are going to have emotional balance also so this is extremely good um, the love of money um, is here but it's okay because you need to have money to um, uh, vibrate whoever that was in an organization that was working against it as huge conflicts in an organization whoever that was in an organization that was spying or working against you it's going to come to an end okay so whatever conflicts you had with the organization this is going to come to an end because you're walking away from this person who is uh, the um, the Aquarius the Libra or the Gemini uh, in the last part of the week and uh, it has an effect because this was an organization and this person for some people I'm getting that um, for some people there was a woman in an organization and you're walking away from her and you are bringing your own balance and stability your life and new energy new vibration are going to be coming out um, the focus of the week is going to be the energy of the hangman and the energy of the hangman is going to be a positive wonderful energy the energy of the hangman is showing you how wonderful it is that the healing is coming in and your healing is really a seductive healing because this healing is uh, no one else have had this healing in this week remember that your spirit guides is a, a week of the um, angelicals because the week begin from the 26th until the 2nd of July and the angelic and the, the veil is thin in this week and it's bringing in healing but yet still it's teaching you no, not to worry anymore and it doesn't really matter who comes up at you uh, with you know the baton and the and, 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 and the sword it's not going to affect you in this week because a, a healing is coming in as I look at this week we had um, a situation that you were leaving behind by leaving behind the situation it's going to bring you financial balance okay you are no longer worried about this um, Queen of Sword, which is an Aries and a Libra or a 
uh, a Gemini because she has no effect on you because she can does do and nothing else to you your financial situation in this um, first part of the week is going to be balanced and with the balance uh, your emotion is going to be balanced with it so as I'm looking at the last part of your week uh, it's going to be a profound one where a situation with the organization you'll be walking away from this person there was somebody in the organization that thought that they were using the button on the sword against you but you're walking away from this person is as if um, I am not afraid of you and I'm not frightened of you and I'm walking away and leaving a situation okay and by walking away and leaving the situation you're going to see that you yourself bring balance in your life this is going to affect people in different ways um, for some people if your mother was the energy of an Aquarians a Libra or a uh, or a Gemini and your father was the energy of an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius um, it's going to be a change of guards because whatever the conflict was and whatever the situation was you are going on a new journey and this new journey your father is going to help you to bring you to this place okay for a lot of you men it's going to be a wonderful wonderful week the last part of the week because new possibilities new energies success um, and riches is coming in your life um, some of you um, the um, who have a relationship with an Aquarian person or a Libran or a Leo you will be moving away from these people okay you'll be um, no not a Leo but and um, and, and Libran you'll be moving away from these people and whatever it is in your business aspect your business is going to be a success and the Sun is going to shine over you whoever um, you men that was having a relationship with a woman who is an, an again a Libra or a Gemini or an Aquarius you're leaving her behind and you're looking forward and you're moving on to something better in your life so be positive um, people be positive because it's not one of your beautiful readings as you have always gotten but it is a week of cleansing and this week of cleansing is bringing you new beginning your own energy vibration which is in a strength is here and also the energy vibration of um, the emperor is here which is good these are two good or iconic works um, positive works positive in a positive sense um, for you people so whatsoever is happening love is um, the love that is happening is um, with your financial situation whatever is happening and you can say this is a love of money but it's not a love of money it's that once your financial situation is in balance then your emotions is also in balance so both of them works together so don't see it as uh, you know it's a love of money no it is the healing of your financial situation and by your financial aid situation being in yield you are going to see positive new um, aspect coming in your life as we look forward and we look at the energy from the consciousness because what is happening is that the universal and the intergalactic beams are here in this week and their message is wonderful I love this whenever the energy of the um, thing come out it is a solar flex chakra so find your PowerPoint the solar flex chakra that is Archangel Uriel call upon the angel call upon the guides you need to find your inner power again I take action daily to uh, um, that my uh, awaken my personal power so I take action daily that awaken my personal power I take action daily that awaken my personal power I take action daily that awaken my personal power I take action daily that awaken my personal power the next energy that I have for you is the dude please the dude abyss the dude abyss is the number 20 card and remember I uh, these are the funny cards I always use them when the week of healing comes in the dude abyss it's your lucky day 
in your lucky life the dude is patiently waiting for you to come on home let him do the heavy lifting for a change no matter what crazy mess you have gotten yourself in the dude is here with everything you could ever need the dude got your back and rock star this is so wonderful this is extremely wonderful I love this you know the dude a by a beats is I say a beats and this is wonderful because whatsoever is happening the dude is seen as God source creator and whatsoever is happening it says it's your lucky day in your lucky day daily life the dude which is source creator is patiently awaiting for you to come on it home. Let him do the heavy lifting for a change, no matter what crazy mess you have gotten yourself in. The dude is here with everything you could ever need. The dude got your back. Um, rock star. This is a good, this is profoundly positive for you guys. Whatsoever is happening, there is going to be celebration and new life and new possibilities is coming up in your life. Remember to take back your personal power because sometimes people try to take your personal power away and want to lead you in a direction that you really don't want to go. And your guides and angels, source creator, just call up and source creator and says, I am ready. Please take me home. Please help me to um, clean up this mess that I've done because the dude is here, the source creator, the universal angels, the guides, the intellect can, um, guides, the cosmic family is here to help you clean up whatever mess you had gotten yourself in and ask and said yes I am ready I'm asking you for divine intervention in whatsoever situation and whatsoever mess I got myself in and clear it up for me so thank you this is a wonderful reading I want to say to each and every person out there be positive remember that positivity is the only thing that we have right now and love um, love each other um, open up your heart remember to take back your power take back your power because there are people out there who want to take back you take away your power take back your power call up an Archangel Uriel to touch open and activate your solar plex chakra and return take back the power that people were trying to take away from you so I'm leaving you this wonderful message and I'm saying namaste until next week